So to connect your Quest to your computer, you're going to need either a USB-C to a USB-C. Basically, the uh, Oculus charger that it came with, you can use that to plug it into your computer. Or you can use a USB-C, which is uh, like a Thunderbolt, that oval one, uh, the thing that you plug in. You know what I'm talking about. That one, a USB-C into just a regular USB, like point three, point two, what I don't know. Uh, just to a regular USB, and then connect it again. You ha you have to go into the headset and hit allow, and you're gonna need developer mode on. Okay. All right, it's very important. Um, so I know mods for Gorilla Tag have been all wacky recently. Uh, today I'm gonna show you how to get mods while they're wacky and basically all weird and stuff. So, uh, first off, let's start off by saying, you have to, and I mean have to, join, uh, one of the Discord servers for Gorilla Tag Modding. What you can do is join this server, and then it has, um, all of the server links for basically the best ones to join. So, go ahead, join one of these. Uh, first thing you're gonna wanna look for is quest patcher quest patcher is very important to just genuinely run the system uh, it's going to be the 2.30 so this one this is going to be in the link in the description you're going to come over here and then if you have windows you're going to download the one of these i don't know i don't have windows you're going to download one of these. If you have, um, what is it called? I don't know. You know, uh, this one is something. I'll look at it in a second. And then Mac is, uh, Mac OS. Apple. That's what I'm on. Linux. If you have Linux, then get the Ubuntu. I, th I hope that's how you pronounce it. The Ubuntu zip. Alright. So then, if you did all that. Good. You're going to open up Quest Patcher, and then once you open up Quest Patcher, you want to make sure that you have your Quest connected to your Oculus. And also, I forgot to say this in the last one. Make sure, okay, this is very important. Make sure that you do have developer mode enabled. I'll put a thing up. So, once you have developer mode enabled and everything, you're going to come back to this and hit patch my app. Also, make sure uh, SideQuest is a good thing to get so that you can see if your Oculus is connected. And if it is not, just put in a comment and let me know. Alright, so once you hit patch my app, you should get this thing that pops up once it's doing all this stuff. Just hit continue anyway. And then it's sending the a, uh, APK. So give it a second. Alright, and then it's going to... Installing modded APK. Alright, now it should say this. Patching complete. Alright, now you obviously won't have all of the mods here in. So uh, I'll just like... I have some other ones I have to add anyway. Um, no, I'm not getting rid of that. I already know where that is. Um, so, yeah. I might as well just show. I'm going to keep Monkey Map Loader in, though. Mm, disable. No, I'm keeping that one in. Alright. So. You obviously won't have all this stuff in. But. What you will need to do is you're going to have to find Code Gen and Gorilla Utils. Alright? That's very important. You need those in order to run mods. 
you will also need to have the monkey computer. That is also very important. Like, very important. Alright, so we're going to delete that one. And then we're going to browse. Alright. We'll get this one, this one, this one, and this one. Open. Alright, if it says outdated mod, just hit enable anyway. Enable. Enable. And enable. Alright, bam. Now we have everything in. Which is good. You should have the monkey computer activator. The monkey computer. Gorilla utils. And monkey code gen. You should have all that in. Now this next part is all your preference, but I'm just going to show you. So here is all my Gorilla Tech mods. I have a ton. I'm just going to, this is going to take a second to do anyway. Wait, I'm going to drop this out. Eh, whatever. All right. All right. Open. Now this is going to take a minute because I have a lot of mods adding. And it, I'm just going to have to keep hitting enable. Most of them are outdated, but still work. So that is good. Okay. Now you have them all in. Good. Oh, also unenable this one. Alright, now you have them all in, which is good. Make sure you have all of the uh, monkey code gen, gorilla utils, monkey computer, monkey computer activator all in before you do anything else. Because that is going to benefit a lot of things. And then you can come over here and put in the hats, maps, blah, blah, blah. Alright. So now we're done with that. You're basically done. But there's a few things that you should know. When going on to do it, do not hit restore. Please do not hit restore. If you hit restore, then just plug your computer back in and just hit patch my app. Enable the mods you want and you're good to go. It's that simple, but please do not hit patch my app. Now, if you get Gorilla Cosmetics, you can add hats. Hats, uh, materials, and if you have the, uh, what do you call it? The monkey map loader. You can add maps. So that's a cool thing. But that is pretty much about it that you have to do on the computer. The rest is completely your stuff. So in the Discord, you can just find mods. Do, mods do get updated, as you see. Uh, these mods, these two just got updated. Uh... The main person who's doing all these that I know of is a uh, you Yukati. I hope I pronounced that right. If I don't, uh, please correct me. But Yukati is the one who's making most of the things or the good ones that I know of. I don't really know of many other ones that are uh, new and updated. Don't get me wrong. The mods are good. I just don't know if they're updated or not. But they still work. Alright, that's important. I don't want to drag this video on for too long. So that's about all you need to know for this stuff. So, yeah.